Hello, I'm just gonna make a quick video on uh, my fan upgrade for my uh, newly built Phantom 2 uh, Black Edition 555 3.2 gigahertz processor. Um, that's the one that came on it. I'm gonna be replacing it with the uh, Hyper 212 Plus, the Cooler Master, very affordable uh, CPU fan. Um, yeah, so see how it fits in this uh, V3 case. Um, you know, I heard I had pretty good access in the back. Let's see if I can turn it around here. Take this back off. Oh yeah, yeah. That would be kick-ass if I could get uh, get this cooler put on without having to take the motherboard back out. Um, so, yeah, we'll see in a bit. See how it fits in there. Hope it doesn't interfere with that uh, memory. But all right, let's check this out. All right, I'm not gonna get into any uh, like crazy unboxing or anything. I just wanted to show everybody the the comparison between uh, this is the uh, factory cooler that came with the. Uh, the Black Edition 555, and uh, this is the Cooler Master that's going in its place. I mean, it's kind of funny because when I first got this thing, I, I kind of thought that cooler was pretty beefy, but I was kind of hoping it had the, you know, the one with the uh, copper tubins, which they should put in there anyways, because you know people are gonna go mess around with this thing. It's a Black Edition, you know, you're gonna try cranking it up and unlocking cores, which, which this did on, end up doing is unlocking the other two cores. But um, that's pretty nasty, huh? But um, anyways, just want to show the comparison uh, before it goes in, right there. All right, all right, and there it is, all installed. Cooler Master 212, uh, Hyper Hyper Plus, something like that. Um, looks like it'll fit just fine, as long as I don't have to take out my RAM anytime soon. <laughs> um, so yeah, clean, better looking than the last one should cool you way down. Alright, thank you.